Hey, what's up everybody? My name is Cap and welcome back to the channel for some more Alpha 21 Lone Survivor. Starting to turn this little storage container into a home. Spent the evening beating on what was pretty much that over here, broken doors, and then just put in wooden plant, wooden panels over here to upgrade it so I can easily, easily jump back and forth between the two of them. Gave myself some storage, cleared out a little bit of the trash that was in here, and got a campfire. But I gotta go. I gotta find a cooking pot. I have recipes and ingredients. I just can't make anything. Um, at the end of the last video, I forgot to open this, so I left it where it was at so you guys could see what I actually got. I didn't want to leave you guys behind here. So, let's see, we got shotgun crafting. That's not bad. Puts our shotgun level on five. I'm not making myself a pipe shot. I just don't want to. Spear crafting, nice. Takes that up to level nine. That's fantastic. And vehicle crafting. We'll be a bit before we can get to that. Okay, so real quick, what I did do was I put one skill point in two... Where to go? Pack mule, because I'm tired of being encumbered. And then I put the other one into pain tolerance. So I can take a little bit more damage before absolutely getting stunned and wrecked and all that. So I wanted to see real quick where we are here. So I am one away from being able to make a level five spear. I'm going to hold off on making a four and see if maybe by the end of the day I have actually completed that or not. So I want to try and find a cooking pot today. Uh, there, I think there's a couple peel lot. I think there's a couple POIs that possibly give you a slightly better chance than others, but I don't necessarily remember which ones they are. So if I'm doing some work for Trader Dude, you know, because he gives us a bunch of books, maybe she's bringing me a cooking pot. She did not. She brought some ammo and some vitamins. Oh, that's not bad. It's not bad at all. And I've made all the pocket mods that I can with the current stuff that I have. The only thing I'm going to be able to do from here on is hope that I can find some doubles. Uh, which may or may not happen. We'll just see how lucky we get. So far, our looting in this series has been okay. And uh, again, thank you guys for everybody who's uh, over here checking it out. Um, I was re-watching one of the videos as I was editing it here. I completely forgot to check out this little trailer. I don't know if there's any in, anything in here, but we're going to check it out. I'm going to leave that behind because I've got plenty at home. And uh, there's a ladder going upstairs, too, but I don't know if there's anything up there or not. So we're definitely going to run up there and see. Search garage storage for some gun. I'm going to leave you behind right at the moment. Didn't check you, though. Uh, more rocks and feathers. We're okay on all of those. So what I was really hoping I might be able to find while I'm up here is... I doubt there's anything in here. Or oh, some books. Come on, spear book. Harvest tools and bow crafting. I can make a primitive bow level too. Sweet. Not too bad. Not too bad. What it would really be kind of cool is if there's a way to figure out a way to get behind the counter where Trader Dude is at. Because he's got a bookshelf back there. Is there a way on this bus? How did a bus get up here? They have some primitive crane. Ooh, golden raw tea. That's lovely. I'm going to have to spend a little bit of cash today and get some more food. Because this is pretty much all I have. Food's a little bit low. Actually, I'm going to go ahead and drink one of those because that'll give me a little bit. Top it off there. Come on, steak or burgers or one piece of coal. <sighs> it's not at all what I wanted. Hang on, let me make sure I didn't miss anything else up in here just in case since I haven't been up here yet. Can't tear apart anything. Uh, nope, I was hoping maybe I could like break the rug or something and get down there. He's right below me, so somewhere around here, if there's a way to get in behind him, I would like to think that I could find it. Oh, hang on, there's a, there's a little opening right there. Can we get back here? Ooh, is this a way to get back there? Hang on, go duck mode and... Okay, so did they code in a way so that you can't get back behind the trader now? That's not cool. Because it looks like I was just kind of floating there. And how the hell did I get out of here? Uh-oh. Okay, pro tip. Don't curl down inside that little crack over there, which I think that would pretty much be the case no matter where you are in life. If you see a random crack, don't crawl in it. You never know what kind of horrible things you're going to find. Sure, I'll take the plastic, and I didn't search this destroyed chemistry station. Some coal and some golden rod. I doubt I can make, well, I don't think I can make golden tea. Golden tea, I mean, I know how to do this. I'm just wondering if I have the ability to make it, if I have to have a, a campfire. A campfire. Cooking pot. Come on, Cap, figure it out. Words. You don't happen to have a cooking pot, do you, that I could borrow? 
You don't. Yeah, I thought it, I thought you might. Guess we'll sell all that and sell all that, get a little bit of the extra money. You did restock today, so do you have any mods that would be good? Do you have any tools that would be good, or any weapons, any books that would be good? Uh, not really. I mean, things that would be good for sure, but not right at the moment. Yeah, okay. I'm back now. Yeah, I will. All right, let me see if you have any good food. I'm a little bit low on it here. Uh, let's see. The chicken soup does okay. It does not as good as that. And that's about it. I'm gonna, I guess I'll go ahead and buy you for now, just so I have you. All right, get a little bit of food in us. Water's going back up. We should be okay. Yeah, I think we'd be okay. All right, dude. Send me to do a job that doesn't suck. A real close one would be nice. Clear. Okay. Friend, Shade Tree Auto. Really that one slightly kind of sounds new. It's going to be right down the street from our base, so we can stop by that little chest right in the middle of the road and... Dang it. I, I keep trying it. One day I'm going to get it to work. The double E is what I'm working on. I'll take you. Let's go say hey to Brucey boy. What you doing, man? You're not doing much, are you? Okay. All right. So let me see where you are on the map. Have we even been there? Okay. So this is kind of within area here. We need to we need to get over there and see if, if nothing else, if maybe if there's another house nearby, what I might do is swing in there since they have kitchens. Maybe have a likely chance of finding a cooking pot. That's the word I was trying to say earlier that I couldn't quite word. Uh, let me see. Which... Actually, my base is this way. I think it's kind of cool. Initially, I was like, you know, I don't think I'm going to use this as my permanent home. The little uh, trailers stacked in the background, the shipping containers. But overall, I kind of like it, honestly. It's not been bad. I mean, it, it's not bad right now. It's a little bit different. And... Where the hell is my house? <laughs> I'm not sure. Okay, so there's Trader Bob's. So I think my, I think it's right over here. Yeah, there it is right there. All right, stupid. I need to probably put a uh, bedroll down over here. I have no idea where I put the last one, but it's definitely not here. All right, let me drop off a couple things. Real I'm just going to use you real quick. I'm not going to need it anyway. And good to go. Yeah, let's miss, let's miss the jump. It's what we always do over there. So guys, thank you so much for all the support on the series so far. I hope you're having a good first week in Alpha 21. I'd love to hear your experiences that you've had after it's been out for four or five days by the time you see this. You know, leave in the comments. I want to know how you guys are enjoying it, what you like. You can tell me what you don't like, but let's, you know, we don't have to turn it into a, a gripe fest of, here's a long list of all the things I hate. Because even in the things that you may or may not like, you can always find a few things that are good. Me, that's one thing I wish they would change back is the music or the sound effect when you start and end a quest because it sounds like a Windows error. And every time I hear it, I keep thinking a mouse came unplugged or something. Let's peek around, make sure there's nothing in here that we should probably get before we start it. Shade Tree Auto. All right. Start you up and see what kind of trouble we can get into. Who dat? Is that Glenn? Are you stuck? Don't take it out on the truck, dude. It looks like it's seen better days as is. We don't need you over here making things worse, sir. Cool. All right, we'll check around you. So this is just a clear. So as long as I kill everything effectively and efficiently, we should be able to get in and out of here pretty quickly. I usually try, if you're new to my channel, I usually try to get through the tier one quests with the trader dude somewhat relatively kind of sort of quickly most of the time. And that's more or less just, I might as well take it. And that's more or less so I can get a bicycle. So we can schlep our happy butts around just a little bit faster. Okay, I guess we can try to go in through the back door. I don't have a wrench, so I don't think I can wrench that apart. Hey, it's Jiggles. I have been in this garage before. This isn't the new POI. It's not one of the ones they redesigned. Don't lose your head, lady. Let's see if you got any water for me. Nope, some gasoline. Hang on, we'll check the trash in the corner because I don't have to beat on that. One rag. You know what I should probably do is switch this back to the standard shape in case I need to use it real fast. I'm not on my heels trying to rotate the shapes around and figure out which one's actually going to help me climb something. Gas and repair kits. Okay, that's not terrible. Repair kits aren't a horrible thing. I do not have a wrench. Uh, can I even get in? I can. Beat you out of the way real quick. See if we can kind of be quiet about it. Get rid of the noise traps. Check your corners. All right, so you're unlocked real quick. You are also. We'll do the first door. Anybody in the banyo? 
Nice and clear. Cool. Cool. One thing of murky water. I'm going to have a ton of murky water available to use for different recipes and stuff because I have been finding a lot of it. Of course, the problem is no cooking pot, so I can't make anything with it. It didn't even step on the noise trap. Sid, that ain't cool. I called BS. Stay your happy butt down. Uh-oh. Stupid, I got hung up in the door. I was just about to say words. I was just about to say, hey, I feel like I've been doing better with getting... Uh, with, I've been doing better with the spear lately, and there I go. Oh my god! Proof spear crafting, yes. Bow crafting, nice. Explosive crafting, food crafting. Two on the salvage tool crafting, that's cool. And robotics crafting, nice. That's fantastic. So now I should be able to make myself a much better spear, right? Yeah, I have the max. I have max stone spears created. That's freaking awesome. I don't have any rocks on me or anything that I would need to be able to do that right this second, but we can definitely get to that real quick, fast, and in a hurry. Good water. Or murky water. If I can find myself a... Uh, if I can find myself a water filter to put inside my helmet, then I don't... Whoops. Then I don't have to worry about whether it's murky or not. Okay, let's see if we can get a sneaky shot on Bo here. Technically, we did. Oops, hang on. Come down here where I am. I was trying not to wake everybody else up. Did you bring my spear with you? I mean, my arrow with me? And this place is clear. Or at least according to the quest it is. Yeah, I may have to reach out to my contacts at the Fun Pimps, which I don't have, by the way. Some people do honestly think that I have uh, a one-on-one -on -one conversation with the Fun Pimps on a regular basis. Drum magazine mods, that could be useful. Ooh, yes. Let's do that. Get that health back, scrap you, and take that ammo. Nice! That'll get our food and stuff up. Thank you, Thigh Master. Uh, no, I don't have any more contact with the Fun Pimps than you guys do. During the streamer weekend, we had a special spot where we could report bugs. But, you know, the big guys up at the top of the totem pole there, we don't talk to them. We have some back and forth with some of the devs now and then, but it's not like... Savage tool crafting. But it's not like we, uh, you know, have this rapport with them that we can go back and forth and be like oh here's exactly what i want you to change for the game i wish we had that level of communication but they can't possibly keep up with that many people well alrighty then uh let's see because i'm never going to remember for a spear i just need stones fiber and wood so all the stuff that i can get while running around over there go ahead and get some fiber we'll run around back the back side of old grumpy's pub here Grab some more just in case I didn't get enough the first time. If I can find myself a small little tree to beat on, get a little bit of wood. We don't need a ton for it. Make myself a level 5 spear, and that'd just be lovely. Craft. Ha-ha. That's going to be freaking awesome. Now, if I had that little flaming mod that I was looking at earlier, that would be great because then I could put, you know, two more mods on there. We'll go ahead and make that one blue as well. You're good to go and scrap you down. Thank you for your efforts. We have the best spear that we can get at the level that we currently are. I am 100% okay with that. I like the fact that the game is at least trying to lead you down the path that you're in trying to go down. You know what I mean? As in, it's given you a higher likely chance of finding books within the skill tree that you're putting things. Like, I'm in perception. I'm getting books within... Whoa, sorry. <laughs> Accidentally bumped my mouse. Getting books within perception, so at least it kind of makes sense. I've only done like three quests for him, three or four, so we're definitely not going to get the bike from this one. We have great Crafting, prizes. ammo, water. Oh, that could actually be pretty good. Those would be good, but water would be good since we're well, we're out of water. Shotgun. Yeah, let's take the let's take the agua. All right, what else do you have for me here? Uh, let me see. That's a clear. That's kind of close. Passing war. gas. Okay. I already did a passing Next glass. Time. So let's Safe see here. Uh, let me see. Try that one. The dollhouse. I'm going to guess that it's not actually anything to do with dolls. Color, you know, call me crazy, but I'm just guessing that's probably not what it is. Nice. I'm just happy we got a good spear. Which, we, need, we head that direction. Okay. Just happened to be walking past the house, so I figured I'd get up there. One of the things I noticed is that I've got this nice little setup here, and if the zombies ever find me, they could probably make that jump, so I should probably get rid of this fertilizer. I'm going to guess if you beat that down, you probably get some nitrate. That would make sense, you know, because that's usually what fertilizer is kind of made of. 
So it would definitely make sense to get uh, nitrate from that. So I'll hang on to that. I'm not going to worry about it right now because I that's a problem for future cap. You yeah, know how things go here. I make a decision and then I'll just let the other guy deal with it later on. Well, we're almost to there, but there are a few residential places around here. So after we get through this one, we may bounce back and forth and at least run through the kitchens and see if we can find ourselves a cooking pot. Uh, apparently, I've been on this block at least partially. The Schweitzer residence. Looks like they have a greenhouse on top of the house. That's cool. Hey, on. Let me go check your mailbox real quick. Let me see if you got any mail for you. We can always double loot that. Let's see if we... Never mind. Airdrop. Uh, that's probably going to be 500 miles from where I'm at. Just, yeah. Tell you what, we'll do a quick one there. And we'll worry about you at another time. Now, let me check the mailbox. Hey, the mailman deliver. Oh. Well, rat dog, there you go. You can add some more paper to the count that you have going on. By the way, if anybody doesn't know what I'm talking about, you're new to the channel. Uh, rat dog, one of our loyal viewers and Patreon supporters, is uh, keeping track of things in every... Oh, that's cool. Look at that double door. We got a screen door. He's keeping track of stuff in every series and posting it in the comments. Like in one, he kept track of empty cans and another, he kept track of other things. And so if you're ever curious as to how many we found of certain things, just look in the comments and see what he has posted. Hold on. He doesn't see me somehow or another. I'm glad he didn't see me. So anyway, thanks rat dog. Appreciate you keeping a running count on all the things. See, I'm not seeing a cooking pot just sitting out, but it's okay. See if we can't tiptoe around and not wake everybody up. A little bit of corn in here would be nice to have. Okay, you know somebody's in this closet. Or bathroom, I should say. Please don't be a dog in here. Nope, just a Tom. That's right. And he don't have my arrows back. All right, we hide anything here, Tom? The satchel. Might as well go ahead and get that. So let's clear it. Sweet. Found that kind of an accident. I wasn't even looking for it. Don't need the tank. What you got? Your sports bag up here, sir. Some more. Well, they help with lacerations of nothing else. That's how we get to the roof. But we'll finish search of the rest of the house. See if there's any good loot. Ski goggles. Am I rocking any goggles currently? I can't remember. Perception plus one. Since I'm uh, since I'm using the uh, spear skill, it's probably a good idea to keep those on here. I can at least sell the other ones. Ain't no thing. Does that say bong TV? <laughs> Is that kind of like BenQ, but just quite not as good? Who that? Oh, it's Twinker Boy. Sub Sid. Been torturing any toys lately? I'm going to go ahead and get this corn while I'm standing here. Because corn is good. I might as well get the yucca. Now these, from what I've been able to tell so far, I've torn apart one of these during the stream. You don't get anything from these. So there's a ton of aloe there. Those are yucca plants up top. Now oh, that's a yucca plant back there. That's just a potted plant. This is... It looks like lettuce. Honestly, I'm not sure what that is. And a bunch of nitrate. But beating these down don't give you anything. Did you make me any coffee? You didn't make any freaking coffee. Y'all have been slacking. Oh, there we go. Thank you. I needed that. We can use that to make some grilled meat now. Some chili. Yes. It's not a cooking pot, but it's a cooking grill. And that at least allow me to be able to cook some of this meat that I have. Oh, thank you, game. Thank you so much. Uh, I'll worry about getting you later. Sure, I'll get the yucca for that, I guess. No. No, ma'am. We start punching doors and have to start calling you Kyle. Then you went down fast. All right, good to go. Let's see if you had anything in your little micro chemistry station. One thing of water. Oh, check out the water heaters. The details on those. I got some rust going on. That's kind of cool. Man, I want to open these valves and flood this house. You know, like all Home Alone. We're the wet bandits. All right, well, let's run back into this bathroom over here and see what's on the roof. Oh, hey, stupid, stupid bird. You were waiting for me. I didn't have to trigger you and you were already there. You suck. 
All right, keep an eye on all the things. Make sure there's nothing else. There shouldn't be anybody over here. Should be able to just get to it pretty quickly. 762 ammo. Yes, it's only nine, but at least I got 50 rounds, so it, it's something. Some food, maybe. Proves food crafting. That'll take it up to level eight. Boiled meat and yucca juice. I'll take that, that, and that. Nice. Game has been... Oh, that's what I was waiting for. Right there. Yes. I don't have to worry about making freaking water. Now, do I have... I still only have a level, wood pa a level one padded hood. Can I make a hood that's a little bit better? Padded hood, I can make a level three. Ooh, I just need duct tape, which I do have some at home and some that too. We can make a level three and I can put this and the helmet light mod in there. And you guys will be able to see better. Oh, that is totally what we're doing. I still want to find a cooking pot because there are some recipes like, you know, boiled water that you do have to have, green tea, red tea, all the drinks. Crafting, okay. All the drinks you do have to have the cooking pot for, but at least with the grill, I can make some meats. So what I may do, level six, sweet. My way to do is uh, just bust in. I've already busted in this house. Was there, no, nope, there wasn't a cooking pot in here. You know what I really need to do? really need to do is I, I should probably do like that stupid that way I know I've been in the houses because I don't have any loot respawns turned I have loot respawn turned off actually and so this would at least give me the knowledge of hey by the way you've been here before that way I don't try and reloot it again there's a big old bunny rabbit you want it Tom you can have it I don't want it don't know if I've been in this house. I know I searched all the mailboxes as I was going down, but that's not really an indicator of... Eh, I guess I'll take the paper. You never know. Oh, hang on real quick. What boots am I rocking? Level twos and these are level threes. That'll give me one more mod slot, but uh, tell you what, I'll hang on to you just in case I need you later on. You're locked. You're locked. Uh, this... Did you make me any coffee? <laughs> Didn't even make any coffee in the extra one. I'm not running through that house. It's not happening. I don't want to. There's a whole lot in there. I think I know... Hang on. I think I know this house. I swear, this is the house that I just did the, the house flip in the Rags to Riches series. Is it not? Crap, I can't remember. No, 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 no. This one is the one you go in through the attic. Okay, well, we could do that. We got inventory space. We got time. Are you actually better than this one? Eh, you are. Nice. Okay, so let's take you off real quick because we can get an extra mod slot on the level three. I don't have anything to put on there just yet, but eventually I will. Scrap you, repair you, and cool. Thank you, game. Look at that, slowly progressing. We're still in caveman mode here, basically, but still, we're getting closer. One small step at a time. And nobody's in here. Oh, hey, what's up, beggar? Trying to go all drunk and monkey on me? We don't tolerate that, sir. No, sir, we do not. Let's see if you had anything good in the bathroom. That's good stuff. I'll start taking the lead so I can uh, convert it into ammo just to sell it, if nothing else. Okay, no chance we're going to get these quietly. This is a big closet. Look at this. I mean, there's... Okay, so it's a giant closet, but there's no story. You got one rack for hangers, and that's it? Uh, I'll scrap you. Yeah, I could sell you, but I'm not really in the need for money. I mean, there's things to buy, but I don't really need a lot of it, you know? So I'm, I'm not hurting for cash like I was in the... Rags to Riches series, so I don't have to worry about... Hanging on to every single little piece of everything, you know what I mean? Okay, take that, and did I get enough random crap laying around to make a spear? Nope, I need more plant fibers. I swear I just picked some... Oh, yeah, I did pick some up. I need a little bit more wood anyway. No big deal. You're locked. Nobody behind me? Shh. Was that you making all that noise? Sid, you, me and you have been having a lot of run-ins lately. I'm going to stab you in the back of the head. 
Yeah, we have definitely run into each other a lot lately. Is anybody back here? No, nobody's back there, really. I'm surprised, honestly. Usually there's always somebody right behind everything that I'm going into. Okay. What? Hang on. Why am I up here? Uh, hold on. Maybe, I, maybe I'm supposed to... There we go. Now we slide down to the bottom. Okay, I knew it was like a one-hit thing to get in, but I thought maybe it was the floor. What do we have? Salvage tool crafting. So that'd be like a wrench. What is my salvage tool up here? I'm curious real quick, since we've been getting a bunch of those lately. Level 5. We can make a level 5 wrench. I mean, I don't have what I need to make it, of course. You know, like a workbench. But at least I technically can. Bruce is just dog-tired. You can keep on sleeping, sir. I won't bother you. Nope, don't need either one of those. You gotta have some main loot around here somewhere, right, man? Come on out. Do your thing. Tweaker! What's up, Kyle? What you doing here, man? Besides making a tremendous amount of noise like usual. Take you, leave that behind. Bathtub could definitely use a bleaching. That is some nasty stuff. What did you do in here, man? This whole bathroom is just disgusting. Clean up after yourself. There's some sandwiches, but I don't really need those right now. One piece of plastic's not bad. Wood, lock picks, and rocks. Nice. If I had a couple plant fibers, then I would be on with making myself a new spear. And I guess we're going downstairs. Like, you gotta go up to go down. Then you gotta go down to go up. Oh my god! You idiots almost killed me! You bunch of morons! Watch where you're stepping, man! God! Just almost freaking ended my existence here. I would have been unhappy if I'd have died because these idiots were just ambling over here not paying attention to where they're going. I and mean, that's my job. Popping some tops here. Like it. I like it. Can I have my arrow back? Thank you. I don't need the leather right now. I'm, I'm already in the encumbrance zone, so I need to make sure I don't add to that. Okay, kitchen. I need a cooking pot. So you're going to be in one of these cupboards. I can feel it. Well, there was not. We found some cornmeal. We have a decent stack of that. A couple of ears of corn. A whole lot of stanky, rotten, nasty meat. But did not find anything else. And into the basement we got to go next. But I think we need to check in here. Medicine cabinet, just in case. That'll help out a lot. I'm glad we have the big first aid kits instead of just the bandages. Because we just got rocked by those landmines. It's the idiots that aren't paying attention here. Here, let me out you out. Sylvia! Hey, what's up, girl? I'm happy to see you. Are you happy to see me, too? I bet you are. Hey, she's my girl. She's been my girl since Alpha 1. They went and changed her outfit a little while ago, and I'm not quite sure if she's happy about it. The other one had a little bit more room to breathe, but, you know, times they are a-changing. I'm not going to bother dying something like that. BDU bottoms. Okay. 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 Um, okay, somebody's unhappy. What currently am I wearing as far as pants go? I am wearing BDU bottoms, so I could just scrap those. They don't sell that much anyway. We're a little chunky. We're on the plus eight on the old chunky scale here. I'm just trying to get to the main loot. What y'all doing? Hey, Sil, what are you doing back there with Sid? You better stay away from my girl. Excuse me, Sylvia. I'm talking to him. Hey. Don't get defensive over him. Don't get don't be defending him. He doesn't deserve that. He doesn't deserve that at all. I'm I'm heartbroken, I tell you. you just, my little my little heart is just it's broken. I don't know if it'll ever be repaired or not. I mean, yeah, in the last testing video I did run over you with every vehicle that's in the game a few times. So maybe it was worth that? I'm not sure. Hang on, Skeletor. I need you to back all the way up.
And Dunskies. How many lockpicks do I have? I've got eight. I might be able to get into that gun safe. But we're going to check all the stuff I don't have to break open first. Money! Some pipes. We're a little chonky. Tell you what, I'll leave those behind. Um, I'll eat you. I got a little bit of extra water, so if I need it, I can. And I need to hang on to everything else because it's mine. Workbench, repair kit, and some more iron. Nice. What were you hiding back here, sir? Dye and some more nasty meats. Not taking that. Glue. Nice. Use that to make some more duct tape. 762. It's 9mm. I don't need 9mm right now. Figured out how to hack on purified water. That could be useful, but I guarantee I need a cooking pot for that. Let's see, food, a level 2 primitive bow. That is definitely better than the one we're rocking. So let me swap you out real quick. Cooling mesh mod and some shotgun ammo. Eh, it's okay. What do you have? Spear crafting skill. Nice. See, I'm Oh, I've unlocked iron spears. Nice. Okay, so we're into the iron spear group here. But again, you can't... Okay, so I have a level 5 stone spear. The first two levels of iron spears is not as good as the level 5 stone spear that I have. So it, it wouldn't even be worth making it. So it's one of those that I'm going to have to just try and... Um, Get my spear crafting all the way up to the next one. Shotgun 762 and the bow. So eventually we'll work on getting another an iron spear going, but right at the moment it wouldn't do us any good. We are full, so whatever's in here, I'm gonna have to leave some stuff behind. Well, we broke a chunk. We broke about half of them here, but we got into the old beaver box, so maybe there's something good in here that was worth it. Spear crafting, that's what I was just needing. Find more ammunition and loot, that's not too bad. That, and I'll just scrap you. Was it worth it? Yeah, I certainly think so. I mean, one extra book is always nice. I'm never gonna be unhappy about finding books that are within the same genre I'm looking for. Always need some extra spear books. We have enough time, we can get back over to Trader Dude. Let me out. Get back to Trader Dude, collect our stuff for our quest, drop some stuff off at the house. I don't have any room for plant fibers. You know what? Hang on. I don't need bones on me right at the moment. Let's drop Let's drop off a couple things that I definitely don't have to have just to clear up a little bit of space. Okay, it's about all I want to drop off. Put the cooling mesh mod on top of our in my boots that I just picked up that I'm sitting on. Cleared up a space. Drop some bones. We're good. We, we're just going to have to walk a little bit slowly. We don't have too far to have to go to drop things off to him. Assuming we can get around this place. Nice. I need to put a... Yeah. I need to go ahead and gather some plant fibers while I'm around here. I'm going to need that to make myself... Wait, never mind. I already made a spear. I already have a level 5 spear. I don't have to make another one. But um, there was something... Yeah. Uh, apparently I already have... Okay. I don't know why I was thinking that. Oh, I need the plant fibers to be able to make myself a bedroll. So I can drop it off in my house that's right here. So here's the plan on Home Sweet Home, is eventually what I'm going to do is I want to break off those doors and seal that off. And then from within side, get a little stamina so I can jump, from within side, you know, bust open a hole through this, which will take a while, and put a ladder down so I can put like my stations and stuff in there. So this can be like my living quarters where I cook and make foods and stuff. And then uh, down there will be where I can make stuff. It'll... It'll be kind of cool. I think it'll be kind of cool. Drop off a few things real quick. All right, so I can make myself a little bit of grilled meat, and that's about it. That's okay. All right, so I figured out what I was wanting all the plant fibers for. I was going to make myself a hood. That's what I was looking for, a padded hood. I can make a level three, so I need cloth and duct tape. I didn't need... Let's see, cloth and... I don't have any duct tape. Okay, well, I guess I'm going to need to make some real quick. We'll do five. That'll leave me enough to do that. Put you in here. Craft that. That'll be good to go. Okay. We're good to go. Now I have a spot I can drink just regular old murky water. I don't have to worry about it anymore. And I still got my helmet light mod. Today has been a good day. Yeah, we almost blew up. But it's okay. It was still almost a good day. It was still a good day. It'd be even better if this was the last quest that we needed and dude was like, hey, by the way, I got a nice shiny uh, dino BMX here for you. So if you want to go all Crew Jones, you're more than welcome to. Need assistance? I don't know, do I? Lucky day. It might be. 
762 ammo. Although that could be useful as well. I think the 762 right at the moment would be good. And that's about it. It's okay. That is okay. Hold on, let me sell you real quick. Put us up to 4,200 monies. Let's see, do you, I haven't really looked through what you have since things have kind of switched around. I haven't like really spent a lot of time looking through everything you have here. I can technically make Peace be with you. as when you two here. So I, I know the skill to make. I don't have a workbench, though, so I can't make that even if I wanted to. I mean, the bicycle you don't have to have a workbench for, but the chassis and the handlebars. But if I could buy both of those. Because I see the chassis and a wheel. So he's got just the chassis that take up half of what I have, and wheels nine hundred. That take up. Have a great day now. Uh, I'd be doing so much better if I could get into your little area. There's so many things to loot back here that you you can't seem to reach. Look, there's shelves. There's two bookshelves. There's got to be a way back here. Has anybody figured out a way to get inside his shop yet? There's got to be a hidden door somewhere. A little switch you can flip. Something you can use to sneak in there. See, that was the little spot I was up behind when I accidentally almost got trapped. Accidentally almost. Man, there's there's got to be a way inside. Has anybody actually figured out a way to get inside of his uh, back rooms yet? Because you can't beat anything down. Everything is traitor protected. Well, if you have, let me know. That's going to do it, guys. We're going to head home. I'm going to start uh, organizing my base a little bit more. See if I can get some foods and stuff cooked. Still didn't work. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, do me a favor, leave a like on it. If you're new here, make sure you subscribe. If you're not already, so you don't miss out on future videos. I'm going to put down a bedroll so I don't do anything stupid. And click the little bell so you get notified when I go live with new videos. In the meantime, you guys have a wonderful day. I'll talk to you later.